Well, this video is going to be another free kind of video, but um, I'm going to be talking about one of the probably the most underrated Z fighter um, out of all of them. Uh, no, it's not Piccolo. It's not Gohan. It's not Goku for sure. It's not Vegeta. Um, it's not Tien, even though I like Tien. Uh, it's Krillin. Krillin gets no love. Not as much love as Yamcha over there, but he gets no love. Literally none. Everybody trashes him all the time. He's trash. He dies all the time. Like it's Kr Krillin is is pretty clean. Okay, he's not that bad. But one, one, Krillin makes has some pretty dope techniques. Okay, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, he does die. But let's be honest, everybody dies. Goku died. Piccolo died. Tien died. Yamcha tough. Uh, well, everybody dies. Okay, Vegeta died. It's just like. Everyone dies, you know what I'm saying? I don't think Gohan did yet. Um, but everyone does. Okay. Krillin just no, like, yeah, he may die, but he still does, you know, some some sh some cool shit, you know what I'm saying? It's, you know, he's not all nothing, you know, it's he's still dope. For one, his techniques. I mean he looks kinda lame. But his techniques is one. He has some really clean techniques. For one the Structo disc. He didn't make Solar Flare, that was TN, but let's be honest, everybody knows Corlin doing Solar Flare all the time. They're cheesing it. Um, for real, if you think about it, Corlin, I also, you know, his techniques are cool. Like, he's got the clone thing. I don't think he made the clone thing, but he uses that. Uh, he uses Kamehameha, the scatter Kamehameha. He, he's got some dope techniques, you know, but he also has a likable personality. Out of all the Z Fighters, yeah, you know, they're cool to hang out with and stuff. Like, maybe not Piccolo, that I think it seems me. Goku seems annoying. Not for me. Vegeta sounds like a dick. He, he is one. I would not really want to hang out with him. Trunks, maybe, but I feel like he'd talk to me like, ah, ah, just like talk on like in his angsty voice. Like, yeah, that's cool, but it's kind of cringe. Tien sounds like kind of like the all business guy at the Ryu. You know, the only talking I do is as a warrior. I, I improve to better myself. You know, that type of person. Yamcha seems kind of okay, but kind of just like lame. But Krillin is that cleanest. Gohan, maybe, but Krillin is just seems like that nice guy. You know, he's a pretty nice guy. He's cool. His personality is clean. He may be a dwarf, but he's still clean. You know, it's Krillin. He makes clean techniques. His personality is dope. And I like how he went from being a little dumb, like, sometimes, like, you know, he was pretty dumb. Like, he, for real, homie could've killed Frieza if he thought about it. I don't know about kill, because Frieza could survive as, like, literal pieces of nothing. I mean, like, pieces of just, like, himself cut up. Like, you would think Trunks killed him when he cut him up, but nah, homie was still alive. But, could've death, if he was in pieces, like, what is he supposed to do? Krillin's Destructo Disc can, could cut Frieza. So, if Krillin did hit them so much, they cut him that Frieza literally made them, made his own version of them. That's crazy. When when you're making techniques that everybody bootlegs, Vegeta bootlegged it, Frieza like it, when everyone bootlegs your technique, that's how you know you made a really dope technique. I mean, come on, Krillin. It's pretty clean. You know, sometimes he does choke, but sometimes he does make some pretty, pretty clean moves. Like Frieza, somehow he survived against him for pretty long. And he, if he did the destructors, he would kill them. Well, not kill them, but like mortally wounded him. Uh, that bowl against Cell, oh, let's just go that up. He also came in kind of clutch with the Sensu beans, you know, throwing them everywhere. You know, saying in abridged, he was truly clutch. He was super funny in abridged. You know, he he definitely deserves a lot more respect from his personality, his techniques. He's, he's likable too. He comes in clutch sometimes. He's clean, you know. He sure are. Sometimes he can be like a bruh. You know what I'm saying? He can be a bruh, but but let's not forget, you know, that number one, the number one thing Krillin did, the best goal, the best achievement he has done, and that is pull Android 18. How did Krillin do that? I don't know. He's just that clean. Homie is that clean. He pulled Marin. He pulled Android 18. He, he's that clean. He is just that clean. You know, that, that's the boy Krillin. 
If he's pulling 18, if he's doing all this bull, homie's clean. He's not that bad. Krillin seems like, just like not, because there's been so many times as a kid where it was just, I remember watching the Namek Saga, and it was dope. It was really cool. Because Krillin, Krillin just seemed like the dude who was there. Like, Vegeta was not, not trusted. Like, no, I'm not, I wouldn't. Not Namek Saga Vegeta. Homie was killing people, and I guarantee he killed him. So there's a couple of Namekian children along the way, and among those villages, he just slaughtered for fun. Like, boys talking about Freeza did it all. Like, no, really, don't lie, bro. You definitely liked killing some of those children and innocent Namekians, okay? Even Dende was like, man, fuck you, did. Like, even Dende wasn't having it. But, but Krillin over here, man, like, for one, like, he, he's not just a murderer, he's a, actually you know, a good guy. Most of the Z fighters were just pieces of shit before they even turned good. And Krillin, yeah, he kind of was like a dick, but like, I don't think he was that, like, he wasn't a bad guy or nothing. He was, he was just a dick, you know? And, you know, he, he's not that bad. He wasn't a dick. I like how Krillin also goes from a little dumb, because he could have killed Frieza, he, he was a little dumb. So like in tournament of power, like uh, he was not the best. I mean, it's Krillin. Like these guys blow up galaxies. You know, I didn't really expect Krillin to do much. I was really expecting Tien to do a lot, but Homie just said, "Yeah, I think I'm gonna take you out with me." You know, so yeah, disappointment. Tien, he's the realest nigga in the Z Fighters, but Krillin was not that bad. He was not that bad. He also, uh, he was, he was competing with Blue Goku. Obviously, God Goku, that blue form, whatever, was, he was definitely holding back. Ain't no way, Krillin, he was definitely holding back. But Krillin was also, he still was. Even if he was holding back, he still, that's still pretty strong. He's still pretty strong for a freaking human to get that strong. That's, that's pretty impressive. And homie beat Gohan in that, in the ring out thing. I remember they were practicing... Krillin used the 100 times solar flare and beat Gohan. Okay, in the ring out. So, he's not all that bad. Krillin is truly not that bad and definitely is the most underrated Z fighter.